Hi gang, Mr. Ed here with another episode of Mr. Ed Makes, and in this episode it's more cell art. Now I'm getting a little bit better at this, and I'm testing some things out. And in a previous video I did a cup flip, where you mix the paint, it's in a cup, you put the canvas or whatever on top, you flip it over, and then you lift the cup up, and this is what happens. And, you know, pretty much the results are generally similar, regardless of how you do things but I wanted to try something to see if I can get more cells I just wanted more cells and less webbing and less blending and threading it's all the other words that people use to describe the stuff that they don't want to see or do want to see so I poked holes in a cup as you see there and I'm setting it down and and putting my paints in there and I'm adding a little bit of oil as I go to get this these nice layers of different things so that when it drops through it's it's going to pull and thin in the surface tension I'm gonna get kinda of like bubbles basically and then those are gonna come up and get lots of cells that was my theory and it turns out it was right <laughs> for once and now the next part of my theory is is it gonna stay on the canvas so I thought it probably not it's just gonna run off again like the, all the others but before it does I'm gonna get this on time-lapse because I love watching the paint run in time-lapse I think it's really beautiful and um, it's something you can't see in in real time but it's happening so uh, here you can see it you can kind of see it moving here I think I'm doing this one frame a second is the speed on this so it's sped up pretty well but that paint is kind of solid this way because of the way that I was pouring it through these holes I had a little bit more control it didn't need to to flow as much and this created problems with leveling because there's it it's kind of bumpy so I had to fill in those bumps with some paint so I did that there but you can see here sped up near the centers where there's a lot of really cool action going on but it's slow it's it takes that paint a while to break through that surface tension and come to the surface and that layer to spread out and kind of break apart but it happens so this thing is still maturing over time even though it is really slow here's that same scene sped up twice as fast and you can kind of see it happening and if you notice on the left side the it's kind of migrating leftward off of the canvas and that really shows up when I speed that up faster you can see it's kind of slowly pulling it apart it's pulling the image apart and as it goes it opens up opportunity for these cells to bubble through if they're there if the paint is mixed enough so that's kind of what I'm figuring out with this and I enjoy the process I enjoy the results and the opportunity to create more art like taking pictures of it with different light shining on it like I've done here and and the time lapse that's really fun too and making the acrylic skins that's fun so here it looks like there's a skull in this I see skulls in them all the time I don't know if that's like some Freudian thing but uh, I hope you like this video and I hope you stick around for some more Mr. Ed makes or draws or talks I have some updates coming up here real soon and stay tuned for those thanks for the thumbs up and the subscriptions and comments and everything I really really appreciate it, it keeps me going and until next time as always take care